Welcome to the Game Theory. Today we are going to solve an interesting two-person zero-sum game using Minimax Maximum Principle. Let's recall, when a game has only two players and the gain of one player is equal to the loss of another, then it is called a two-person zero-sum game. We have a 4x4 four four payoff matrix of player A and B. The first task is to find the row minimum. So here we go. Minus 6, minus 8, minus 5, and minus 4. Now let's find the column maximum, which is 5, minus 4, Eight and seven. Now let's go back to the row minimum and ask the proverbial question. Mirror, mirror on the wall, which is the largest number of the month? And the answer is minus four. So let's demarcate it and call this maximum. Maximum. Now let's go to column max and ask mirror mirror on the wall which is the least number of them all and the answer again is minus 4 so let's demarcate that and write this as mini max. Remember the idea is to maximize the minimal profit of player A and to minimize the maximum loss of player B. Now let's write the maximum value that is minus 4 and the minimax value that again is minus 4. So what have we here? Since maximum is equal to minimax, which is equal to minus 4, the game has a saddle point or an equilibrium point. Hence, it's a game of pure strategy, which means that both the players have an optimal strategy which provides the best outcome to each of the players. Let's see what's the best strategy for player A. Now, the best strategy for player A is the row corresponding to the saddle point, and that is 4. And the best strategy for player B is the column corresponding to the saddle point, and that is 2. Now, let's find the value of the game. The value of the game is the amount of payoff at the saddle point. Okay, and that is minus 4. So, since the value of the game is negative, the game is favorable to player B. Remember, when the value of the game is negative, the game is favorable to player B. Hope you found this video helpful. Thank you and happy learning.